What's going on? We're making espresso. So you get your little mug. And what I like to start off doing is getting a little There's lemon zest. No actual lemon flesh. Throw that in. We're going to use that later. So you got an espresso maker. So you have, there's this little line, kind of, or a bolt. You fill it to that line, and then this will go in right after you. So you can get espresso grounds at any grocery store. You're just going to want to fill that to the very top and just simply boom. And so it'll come with a top when you get an espresso maker. Close it. You just want to close it like this. It always takes a minute to close. I have an old espresso maker. Okay. So you're going to want to throw it on the stove until you see out the top where it'll like start to um, get a nice good steam. And with your espresso mug, you could add milk, a little bit of milk, a little bit of sugar. Personally, I'm going to add a little bit of sugar. like to add about an eighth of a teaspoon you could add more doesn't even matter okay so we got the espresso going and i just want to say thank you for everyone that subscribed i finally reached 100 subscribers and let's keep it going. Recommend this channel to your friends or anyone who likes cooking. And yeah, and um, I'm going to comment down below. So um, just say what you want me to cook next. And I'll cook it. I have. Um, I was thinking of doing burgers next. Let me know how that sounds. And yeah, so let's check this espresso. So as you see... It's not steaming yet, but it's almost there. So it'll start steaming, and then it's going to start boiling over the um, top and the inside. And, yeah. Give it a couple minutes. We're good to go. In the meantime, what I like to do is I like... Okay, so it's almost there. Sorry for the wait. It takes a minute, you can't. There you go, now it's starting to really steam. A couple more minutes. Seconds. So what it's gonna do is the water's gonna boil and then it's gonna push the grounds up and into the top and it's gonna start boiling kind of over into a little kind of thing where you get your espresso and yeah espresso is awesome i like you can make a frappuccino with it i like to put a little bit in a little bit of ice a little bit of caramel a little bit of sugar you really don't need it you got caramel and yeah, you got a caramel frappuccino from Starbucks right at home for way cheaper. Okay, so sorry, this video is gonna be a little long. So perfect, it's starting to. There you go, it's done. So you'll know it's done. You could open the top. And you just got some nice espresso sitting there. And yeah, just pour it. Right over your little 
little cup. Maybe stir it up a little bit, and there you go. You got some awesome espresso. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. See you next time.